My name is Marty Ludus and I'm with the Brain Injury Channel and Lash Publishing. Today I'm going to demonstrate ABIME, which is a computer-based program developed by James Jap. ABIME is an acronym for Acquired Brain Injury Memory Exercises. I'm going to show all six of these exercises on the screen and you're going to be able to follow along and get an idea of how your patient will use this program and what they can learn from it. I have the program opened right now and I just have to click the start button and enter my ID password and this will initiate the program. Immediately the six, the six programs are visible and if you hover over the thumbnail it gives you a description of what they are. I'm going to begin with the first exercise, which is going to require me to memorize a series of four numbers. I remember three, four, seven, six. Okay, do the next one with me. One, nine, five, four. Okay, for this one, I'm going to put in 8888 and purposely get this wrong. I'm going to confirm the response and then I'm going to exit. But before it goes to the next program, it's going to show what my score is. So watch, watch as I do this. I'll confirm and then click exit. And I get the uh, exit request here. And now it has, it's, it indicates that I have two correct and one incorrect answers. So this uh, is an example of how the program um, keeps score. The next one is a series of cards that I'm going to flip over and this may be amusing uh, depending on how well I do. Okay, I've got these cards and I'm going to flip them over. There's a duck and a tube of some type. What is that? A cash register? Well, I got a match there. I don't know what it is, but I matched it. Okay. And I've got a duck and something up here, too. I've got to remember. Okay, there's the duck. A dog. I don't remember a dog being there, so it must be one of these. Nope. But I remember this. I remember this shape, and I'm not sure what that is. And the next two should be the dog. Let's do one more. There's a dog and a turtle. Some kind of a cassette player and a man. Wow, all four of these are different. Then. Okay, what was the turtle? That was the second one. Okay. What was the cassette? Uh, right here. Okay. What was this evil man? He was here. Okay, that's about the best I've done on this test. So I'm going to exit and go to another test. But you get a good picture of how this works. Let's exit. And now I'm going to uh, the light sequence. And this can be challenging, so pay attention. Please pay attention.
Okay, I'm going to exit that. I think I did pretty well on that. That is not by any means a simple test. It requires a lot of concentration and um, uh, that will really challenge um, anybody. Now we're going to get into uh, a word contest where we have to memorize words. I like to repeat the word in this exercise. It's just a way that helps me uh, remember something that uh, one of your uh, patients might do. Okay, so let's begin and remember these words. Dig. Dig. Buzzes. Buzzes. Through. Through. Foreman. Foreman. All right, let's see if they're here. Mental. Mental. Not present. Dig. Present. Enthusiastic. Not present. Cinema. Not present. Buzzes. I remember that from saying it. Foreman. Foreman. I think that's in there. Antifreeze. That's definitely not in there. Through. I think that's in there. Okay, I'm going to go to the last exercise now. I think I did pretty well on that. I'm not sure. But the last exercise is very comprehensive. It involves a number of uh, steps that your patient will have to take. And uh, this is challenging to say the least. So let's get to it. Profess. Profess. I have to remember these names or these uh, words. Squadron. Squadron. Brook. Stop. Stop. Firm. Firm. Perspire. Perspire. Bristle. Bristle. Unhappy. Unhappy. All right, I'm supposed to remember these words, and then I go forward, and I've got to look at these pictures. And when I think I can remember them, I'm going to go forward. I'm going to um, continue here, and now the numbers game plays. Now I've got to remember numbers. Nine, one, eight. Four, nine, one, eight, four. Okay, at this point, uh, I can tell you that this uh, exercise continues. It's on a timer, and they will keep doing the numbers game, and the time, timer runs out, and then it goes back to those original words that they were supposed to remember. So this basically goes... Uh, re, uh, covers all of the exercises and um, I think you can tell from watching me do them uh, how challenging they are and how they really can help build memory and of course test it to evaluate it. Uh, one of the things that I like most about the tests is they're unintimidating uh, and they're fun. They're, they're not difficult, they're not that difficult, but they are challenging. And uh, so if you want more information, of course, you can go to the LASH website and uh, find out the prices and uh, get this program delivered to your office.